various complexions of the different medicines, the arc of the experience, the ability to genuinely feel love in this profoundly intimate space of a journey. And to be present as one human being to another is essential. As of this moment, there is no recourse for violations of ethics. People can continue to practice and do potential harm. Recognition is needed for ethical guides to be certified in organizations like MAPS, the Board of Psychedelic Medicine and Therapists, and clinics as they open. Getting in front of the spirit of the medicine seems to be fraught with peril as we watch psychedelic medicine, uh, businesses collapse, stocks plummet, and communities and teachers fall by the wayside. Leo was a front runner as a therapist and underground guide. The role of LSD, the chemist, the extraordinary amounts of LSD and other psychedelics that have been distributed to unknown numbers of people over the decades, and these current surveys around them indicate that people have actually learned a lot since 1967 and the summer of love. People understand set and setting, being in nature, in private homes, with good company, and still, they would appreciate having a guided session as a voyager. Part of the beauty of LSD or MDMA and other designer medicines